Good afternoon. Uh, this is uh, the formerly sh known show, uh, formerly known show of Matt M. Show. Yeah, just got to throw in some dumb words, you know. Anyways, I've always been like that. Anyways, uh, the new the new theme is uh, what I used to go by with my friends is Open Thinking Dude. This is the Open Thinking Dude podcast. The Open Thinking Dude podcast. Still, it's an audio blog until I keep I get better stuff and some money to uh, uh, be pro, like an uh, upgrade. But for the meantime, it's uh, the Open Thinking Dude podcast. I just want to do a mini afternoon audio blog. It's uh, or evening blog now, but it's late afternoon. It'll be evening here in about nine minutes till six uh, Central European time. It's been a nice day. Uh, so, yeah, I'm sorry. It's just been, I just got done vacuuming. But uh, we're just going to do some uh, things about uh, the Miami Heat tonight. I think they play tonight? Or is it tomorrow? Well, I don't know. See, this goofball of impromptus that I do, it's so, like, you know, funny. Uh, anyways, it's not really. This is who I am. I am goofy. I don't want to... It's not about me. It's just about things. This is just a goofy side right now. I'm going to be doing some serious shows again. This is just a mini audio blog of stupidity. Afternoon audio blog of stupidity and some laughter, I guess. Maybe a little news and some updates. I, oh, wait. I should have already told you that. But see, the failure of impromptu is can you think on the fly? Half the time, yes, and half the time, no. But anyways, uh, I think the Heat's going to win the series in seven. And I think the uh, Spurs were gonna, is going to get beat. They're going to get beat in seven. I think Kevin Durant and Westbrook, uh, they're going to come together, hopefully. One of them has an attitude, but, you know, we all have attitudes sometimes. But with that... Go Thunder! Ooh, yeah! Anyways, uh, I always like to give a, uh, the podcast that I really like to listen to. Uh, it's late night in the Midlands. Uh, sometimes uh, Peace and Chili, Gorilla Media Network, and, and this pretty funny guy, Cal Pote Radio, is pretty cool. Uh, pretty uh, Got some original content, which is awesome. And uh, the uh, views expressed in the Reverend Wayne S. Pierce show is pretty cool, and a couple other ones. But uh, I'm going to be starting a, I'm going to be doing an interview. I'm going to get it actually confirmed uh, on the serious side. Now, on the serious note, I'm going to be uh, doing a targeted individual show. I am going to have a guest. Uh, who is a severely heavily targeted individual? Uh, even myself is I'm targeted, but you still gotta have fun and have life, you know. Uh, but I'm gonna have him on the show soon. And if any of you are uh, on the other side, the perps, as they say, come and join. You're blessed too. So yeah, I'm gonna do a show and then. Uh, I'm going to do a show here on the FLDS and uh, an interview Asian culture versus living in a versus and living in the European American culture. So that's going to come up. And it's just a blessed day, you know. I get just, I'm just doing random stuff, random impromptu stuff. It's a blessed day. I know my content needs to get better. I'm just doing goofy stuff like the sun's out and oh yeah you know what's a coincidence okay okay let me let me ask you this guys is it a coincidence that every time for myself because I can only go by myself not any other person but any every time I pass by somebody or you know that supposedly not all but some most of the time say 75% of the time but it's an illusion Maybe it's illusion. I don't know. But anyways, um, always somebody like rubs her head 
or rubs their brow or you know or makes them <clears throat> every almost every single time and it's only a small percentage of the population of of the whole city anyway it makes it look like it's not but it's it's uh it's just a mind thing maybe but you think that's a coincidence or they're like <clears throat> yeah <clears throat> Excuse me. Or they rub their brow. Oh, I mean, I think that could be a coincidence, or it could be real, or it could be. If you look it up, that could be. Uh, I think it's one of those uh, uh, Stasi uh, uh, symbols or things that uh, originated from Stasi, or or maybe even before. I don't know. I really don't know. But yeah, I, I, I'm just wondering if that's a coincidence and. And living in the apartment here in the Netherlands, we always have to have uh, the door, you know, it's locked, it's not like in America. And I always hear like the doors every night, all the time. Is that a coincidence or could it be some weird neighbors? I don't know. Can't pass judgment. But with that, I'm just going to leave you. Is that a coincidence or not? And you're listening now to the Open Thinking Dude podcast on Spreaker Radio. I am out for the day. Have a good Friday. Don't be stupid, be blessed, have reason, and have faith. I'm out.